And that's it. Get ready to start with the warm up. So on Monday, I asked no one to run the warm up. Today, I'm asking no one to run the warm up. So that means on Friday, it's the day one of you runs the warm up or the cool down. Yeah, can be one on the or the other one. Thumbs up if you can see me properly. Can you see me properly? Yeah, perfect. Ready to start, starting with a warm up. Neck, up and down, please. Side by side. Shoulders up and down, shrugs. Shoulder rotations backwards, one, two, and forwards, one, two. Chest open and cross. When you open, palms up. When you cross, palms down and curve your back. Use this movement to warm up your chest and your upper back. Curve your back when you cross. Up and down. Arms 90 degrees, shoulders back and down, squeeze your shoulder blades, press overhead. Squeeze your shoulder blades, press overhead. Get on, bend over, do the same movement. Right leg rotations out. And in, one, two, one, two.
Same for the other one. Rotations out, rotations in. Get one, bend your knees, please. Face on the floor. Rotation, ski rotation from here. Always one hand in contact with the floor. Get one, jogging in the spot now. Move your arms as well. Your flex. Last one, mini jumps, rotations with the wrist. Remember, it's important to warm up the wrist because you have positions during holding the plank, for example. Five, four, three, two, one, and you can stop now, get ready to start the main session. Remember, the exercises for 60 seconds are a bit less, a bit less impact. The ones for 30 seconds, more impact. You, we can always adjust the movements. Fifteen seconds to start. We have three different sets, two different rounds. We start increasing the heart rate, more for cardio, 60 seconds jumping jacks starting right now. Let's go. How do you do this one without the jump? It's simple. Open on one side, open on the other one, yeah? Let's go, we just started. Thirty seconds. Next one is for thirty seconds, and we go straight away on the floor. It's a movement in plank position. It's similar to this one. Opening up and closing legs. You can do with the impact or no impact. Two, one on the floor. You can do it like this or just step. Yeah, let's go. Keep your hands under your shoulders. Keep your back as flat as you can. Open and close, open and close. Avoid curving your back. Three, two, one. Up again, let's move for 60 seconds. Wide position, sumo squats. Let's go. People ask me, how deep needs to be a squat? I want your squat to be balanced and at the same time comfortable. For your level. Normally I would say bend your legs at least for 90 degrees, but I want you to have a balanced position. You can't lose the balance. So if you lift your heels off the floor, you have to adjust that squat. Let's go wide position. We're doing sumo squats. Remember this one was for 60. The next one is for 30. More impact, jumping, turning around. If you can't jump, squat one side, squat the other side. 30 seconds, let's go. If you can't jump, just rotate, yeah? Let's go. Three, two, one, 
good one. Wall pouch to push ups. You can finish the push up with your knees on the floor. Important here is keep the legs straight. Wall couch, push up. Again, if you need knees on the floor, your knees on the floor. You reach this point, knees, perform the push up. Don't rush this movement, 20 seconds now. Next one is for 30 and more impact. We're going for burpees. Again, the part with the push ups, you can do knees on the floor. Three, two, one. Burpees now, let's go. Remember, you can have your knees on the floor for the push up. Three, two, one. Bum on the floor. Let's go for clock crunches. Remember, you can do this one with one foot on the floor. Bringing the other one up, or both off the floor. Upper body, up and down, up and down. And the name is Club Crunch, just for one reason, yeah? We clap. seconds. Well done. I want no one sitting. Resting but standing please. No one sitting. Let's go. I can see you. Again, working 60 seconds and 30 again. Starting standing. We start with sprinter, sprinter lunges, the ones you step forwards and you touch the floor. It's a combination between a triple flexion, hips, knees, ankles, and at the same time, you bend over slightly in order to touch the floor. Try not to curve your back a lot. Try to bend from the hips. Alternating the legs, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Legs bending for 90 degrees at least. Again, you can bend your back slightly, but avoid a big curvature, yeah? seconds next one is for 30 three two one 
jumping lunge just from one leg to the other leg. If you can't jump, lunge back, knee up. Lunge back, knee up. Let's go. Jumping or knee drive. Three, two, one. Keep the low plank position. Just that low plank. I want elbows on the floor. Elbows under your shoulders, directly under your shoulders. Keep your back straight. Twenty seconds. Next one, we work for thirty, and we're going for shoulder taps. I want straight arms, hands under your shoulders, touching one shoulder, the other one, alternating the shoulders. Three, two, one, up. Shoulder taps, one, the other one. Try not to move your back a lot. Just from here. If you struggle with balance, open up wider with your feet. Three, two, one, pikes for 60. Feeling the shoulders returning to plank. Feeling the shoulders returning to plank. You don't need to go lower than plank. Engage your leg muscles, and the way you engage the leg muscles here is you keep your legs always straight. Stiff legs, don't bend your knees. Three, two, one, up and rest. Well done. Last set for the first round. We get on the floor, moving on the side. First one, one knee on the floor, and you have to bend the knee. You have to align your knees one with the other one. But the one in contact with the floor, it's 90 degrees. From there, we lift the opposite leg. From that position, we do the side plank straight away, and then side plank the other side, and then yes, we go for the other leg, okay? Just follow me. 20 seconds, just let's check the position. 90 degrees, align the knees. Everything is aligned here. My foot, my hip, my shoulders, it's a straight line. My elbow, it's under my shoulder. And then from here, I lift the leg up and down. No rotations, toes pointing forwards. Keep the leg in contact with the floor really strong. You don't need to lift your leg all the way to the ceiling. I just want up and down with no rotations, yeah? Thirty seconds now. Ten seconds. Get ready for the side plan on that same side, okay? Three, two, one. 
elbow straight arm, you decide. If you're doing straight arm, I want your hand aligned with your shoulder. And from this position, we don't go for the leg straight away. We swap the side plank, and then yes, the leg. So 10 seconds, get ready to switch arms, switch sides. Three, two, one. Side plank, get a side. That's it, let's go. Check the alignment, proper alignment, please. Again, you can do straight arm or elbow on the floor. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go for the leg. The one in contact with the floor, 90 degrees. Get the one up and down. Again, alignment is key here. You can't rotate your hips. You have to align your arm with your shoulder. And you can't rotate your toes up or your foot up. It's always pointing forwards. 30 seconds. Fifteen now. Three, two, one. Rest now. Well done. First round is done. Well done. How's that? Thumbs up. No? Yeah, good. This one with the leg, it's harder than it looks, yeah? Looks really easy, but after a while, you can feel the glutes. For me, it's the glutes, yeah? Maxim, are you sweating there? Let's go. Second and last round, three sets, 63rd, yeah? 60 seconds jumping jacks, first one. Remember, if you prefer no impact, step one side, step the other side. I'm not asking you to jump, yeah? Different options. Let's go, let's go. No impact looks something like this, yeah? One side, the other side. Position, open and close legs, just legs, tap. Three, two, one, let's go. Again, no impact here or normal ones. Hands along with the shoulders. Wide position, wide position, some more squats, let's go.
Remember, it needs to be in wide position, please. And we do this one for 60. Next one with the jump for 30. Again, if you can't jump, just do the ones rotating. One squat facing that way. One squat facing that way, yeah? Five, three, two, one, let's go. No impact, like this, with impact, jump it. Ten seconds, keep going. Three, two, one, walk outs to push ups. Legs straight, going down. Again, do with your knees on the floor if you need. Thirty seconds. Fifteen. Next one, burpees. Again, the part with the push-ups. Knees on the floor if you need. Three, two. One, and burpees, let's go. Good one, clock crunches. Remember you can do one foot on the floor and alternate, or feet off the floor. Back up and down, up and down, up and down. Ten seconds. Three, two. One, keep the deep position. Remember, you can bend the knees if you need that. Ten seconds. Three, two. One and rest. Standing. Standing. Let's go. Again, sixty thirty. The only one with jumps here. It's the jumping lunges. If you can't do the jumping lunges. Back lunge, knee up, yeah? If you can do from one leg to the other leg. Let's go. 20 seconds, we start with sprinter lunges. Again, stepping forwards. Mix between hip, knees, ankles. 90 degrees, bend from your back. 
Not a big curvature, touch the floor. Not a big curvature with your back. Let's go. Let's go. Touch the floor, both hands. Both hands touching the floor. Ten seconds. Remember the next one with jump or with the knee up. Three, two, one, from one leg to the other leg. Let's go. Low plank, straight away. Elbows along with the shoulders. Keep the low plank. seconds get ready for shoulder taps straight arms shoulder taps three two one up shoulder taps let's go Now, feeling the shoulders, back to plank. Stretch the shoulders, back to plank. Keep your legs straight. You get ready for the last set. Last round, last set. It's that set on the sides, yeah? Remember the alignment, knees aligned, 190 degrees, the other one straight, and the leg straight comes up, straight as well, nothing like this. Leg, leg raise, yeah, one side, side plank. Side plank, leg raise. Let's go, check the alignment. Everything aligned, yeah? Three. 
three, two, one. Let's go now. Let's go, let's go. Double check if the leg in contact with the floor is 90 degrees and your knees are aligned. You can touch the floor and then up again. Touch the floor, up again. Three, two, one, side plank on that same side, on that same side. Again, you can do straight arm or elbow on the floor, it's up to you. seconds. Three, two, one, opposite way. Check the alignment first. Side plank, it's side plank, yeah? Let's go up and down. straight back straight let's go you can't you can't have a bad alignment check the alignment go back to the movement the alignment is really important here three two one and rest now well done Looks simple, this one, yeah? Cool down, basic stretches. Bend your knees, legs together, bend the knees. Bend from the back, try to touch the knees with your nose. If you struggle, bend your knees a bit more, for sure you can do it. Keep the position, extend your legs, keep your back like that. Try to reach your toes. If you can't reach your toes, just stay down. Legs completely straight, even if you can't reach the floor. Up slowly, extending your back side by side, slowly, slowly up, slowly. You know, I'm stretching quads. Keep the balance, use the wall, use something if you need. The important part here is the stretch, not the balance. You'll have time to work the balance on Friday. Uh oh. Same for the other one. 
Good one, crossing right, right leg in front, bend for your left side. Slowly, back to the middle, opposite leg, left leg in front, bending for the right side. Back to the middle, four movements in a row. First one, open your chest, squeeze your shoulder blades, Chin up. Pop your chest out. Second one, overhead. Next straight, bring your arms overhead. Overhead is, if you look up, you can't see your hands. That's movement number two, yeah? Movement number three, bend over. Reaching forwards, chin down. Movement number four, move your arms behind your back. Pop your chest out again. Back straight, almost done, shoulders. The other one. Last one now. Dang. The other way. Now, well done. Really good. How was that? Good? Thumbs up? Yeah? Well done. I will see you on Friday. Five again, yeah? Three small objects. Can be candles, can be a toy, can be this. It's up to you. Three small ones. That's what we need. Just that. Yeah? Take care, stay strong, bye-bye.